Good morning, Titan Nation. I'm Arletis, and we're back. And I'm Frank. Today is Monday, November 25th, 2013. And we want to give a huge shout out to Mrs. Witt. Please stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please take your seats, Titans. The newest Titan sweatshirts are now available, Titans, for $25. You can buy them in the activities office. Titans, keep our campus clean. Please remind everyone to dispose of their breakfast and lunch trash properly. Now over to Ms. Santa Maria with an important message on the ACT. We know the next SAT and ACT test will be in December. In order to help you get ready for those tests, the College and Career Computer Lab will be focusing on test prep starting this week. You can come into the lab and review on your own through Study Island and the SAT and ACT websites. In addition, there will be tutoring available to students who signed up to take the ACT. During the initial tutoring session, students will review a specific test section. After the review, students will take a pretest on that section and they will score their own pretest. This will help students identify areas needing improvement and allow students to create a study plan for the next few weeks. Test prep sessions will run from 2.20 to 4 in room 1201F. The schedule for pre-test sessions will run as follows. Monday, November 25th, English, and Tuesday, November 26th, Reading. Test prep tutoring will restart on December 2nd and run through December 12th for all sections. Thanks for The unique academic team took first place in their competition yesterday versus Palmetto Ridge, Immokalee, and Laley High Schools. The team demonstrated exceptional academic skills as well as exemplary sportsmanship. Team members include Brittany Bushard, Natalie Galindez, Logan Seifert, Yesenia Villeda, Alfredo Bonetta, Charles Bayon, Anthony Baez, Philip McQuillan, and Matthew Fisher. Great job, Titans. It's time to save your money so you, don't, so you do not want to miss out on a once-in-a-lifetime seniors activities. If you plan to walk at graduation on May 30th, you must have a GGHS cap and gown. Herf Jones will be on campus one day to take your orders. January 16th, 2014, caps and gowns cost is $56. If you plan to borrow from a friend who graduated from GGHS recently, you still need to purchase a tassel and medallion on January 16th, $30. Start planning for Grad Bash. We go April 11th, 2014, 2.30 2 p.m. to 6 a.m. You must be in good standing to graduate on May 30th. A permission slip is required for all seniors in order to buy your ticket, even if you are 18. Purchase your ticket and select your bus this week of January 21st through 27th for $120. Neo or Treshawns will be performing and you get access to all rides if both parks start saving money now. You only have five days to purchase your grad bash tickets. So mark your calendars, January 21st through 27th, $120. You only have one day to order your cap and gown, January 16th. $56. These dates are close together, so plan ahead, Titans. No Shave November is almost over. Donate cash for your favorite stash. A handful of Golden Gate High School teachers will be growing out their whiskers, or have been growing out their whiskers, in the hopes of raising lots of cash for the Cancer Alliance of Naples. The participating No Shavers will, are taking donations up until Thanksgiving break. Here are today's and tomorrow's clubs. Thanksgiving holidays, Mrs. Will's Kids Scan meeting has been rescheduled to today in room 5206 at 1145. They have lots to discuss as, our, as your activities will be heating up for the holiday season. The boys soccer team have a game tonight against Cape Coral here at home. Come on out and support the guys. JV, you will meet at 430. Good luck, guys. 
The Titan Wrestling Team competed this past weekend in the Chase Live Tournament, held at Palmetto Ridge. The entire team wrestled top. These six wrestlers made it to day two. Spencer Zapka, Giovanni Restrepo, Alex Hernandez, Frankie Jaramillo, and Joe Harker. The Titans are in action next weekend in North Miami for the Joe McDowells. The boys' basketball team takes on Naples High tomorrow night, and we have to pack the place. All students can get in for just a dollar if wearing any kind of Golden Gate Spirit shirt. Come out and see the rise of the gate in action and show the Eagles that we have the best fans in town. Again, the ticket is only a dollar. Tomorrow for all GGHS students wearing any kind of Titan Spirit shirt. Girls Lacrosse, you have a practice you have practice today after school. Don't miss it. The swimming team has a meeting at lunch tomorrow, November 26th, in Miss Gabby's earlier childhood room 4109. Now over to the Friday's vocab week in review. Yo. Yo. Shout out to the Hammond School in San Francisco, California. We see you. Flow cab in the house, here we go, here we go. You want the headlines, here's your weekly dose. J.P. Morgan, J. Settle a lawsuit by paying the government a whole lot of them. 13 billion. 13, but the case still isn't over. It seems that some executives could be criminally charged for the housing collapse that the methods called. In other news about crimes worth billions, we found and crushed six tons of seized ivory by we. I mean, the U.S. Wildlife Department. They want to put it into elephants being slaughtered for the ivory, which comes from dust. Animals have rights too. Enough is enough. There's violence and kidnappings happening in Tripoli. The government says the militia has to leave. The tension in Libya continues. Used to mount. The militia only had three days to get out. Tornadoes tore through the Midwest, leaving Illinois crushed in at least six dead. After wind speeds of 160 miles per hour, some were left without houses, others without power. Kill switches for smartphones were rejected, which seemed like a cool way to protect it. And selfie? That is a slang you hear, cause Oxford Dictionary's made it word of the year. Global studies show that if we travel to the past and raced against our parents that we wouldn't be as fast. That's sad, we can't beat mom and dad. I bet in video games they would be no match. Now, we are going to take you out with a video from Sherrod Wilson, Gerald Torres, Janie Suarez, Brand and Brand Brandon Gillen. Have, Have a, a great, great Monday, Monday Titan, Titan Nation. Nation. Sorry if I said your name wrong. Test your life.